Welcome back everyone. So I'm just going to do a quick video on how to do the rear LED tail light upgrade coding. Um, obviously with it usually you can use the resistors on, on the tail lights um, just to convince the car that it has got the normal bulbs so it see the right resistance. Um, mainly because it will throw up a check error uh, warning light on the dash. Um, I think it's uh, brake light, check light malfunction. Um, because the LED lights use less power so there's less resistance on the circuit and the car throws up a fault. I might say you can use the resistors but they get really 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 hot um, and, and tend to fail but what you can do is you can convince the car as always with a little bit of coding on uh, DTT for all um, and that will uh, obviously tell the car that you've got LED lights now and shouldn't throw up that warning. I'm currently not connected to the car and um, so it'll be slightly different but I will explain all. As always you need your DDT for all software usually you have your USB or Bluetooth connector up there you click on the USB um, click on I'm aware that I can harm my car and then connect I'll be going into edit mode as always normally you click on the little search button that will then start loading all your ECUs down here and then populate the ECUs in here that you can find on your car. And then what you need to do is you need to go down to um, it, it, sometimes it says EMM Edison but on mine it says UPC EMM. Uh, it makes no difference. Um, it's, it's the same. I've just got the newer uh, software and again in there it populates a couple you just go to the newest version next screen again just double click on that once it populates down the bottom we need to scroll down to EMM lighting and EMM lighting configuration so what we need to do is find a couple of things. So the first thing we need to do is this MBX tail 1, 2 and 3 with LED. Currently it's shown 0 and 0. What we need to do is change the right screen to 1 on all 3. And then we scroll slightly further down and we're looking for MBX stop with LED CF. Again, it says 0 and 0 just change the right to 1 head up hit your Einstein button and then hit send then obviously it will start loading down here on populate to say that has been done um, refresh the screen and then it should say where you've changed them it should show 1 and 1 um, and that is the coding done um, there is other ones that you need to do in regards to uh, if, if it still throws up the same morning light in regards to the stop light and the indicators um, but as always if, if that does happen uh, drop me an email give me a shout and I'll explain what you need to do just to rectify that but in most uh, circumstances this will rectify the uh, check light fault when uh, converting to LED as always if it's helpful please like the video look to the sub subscribe I've got lots of other videos coming up soon. Um, as always, if need be, likes, comments, questions in the comments section. If not, drop me an email and um, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But, uh, thanks for watching.